here we go. All right, so Michelle asked for some of our, some of my little disco stuff. All right, so we're gonna start back. Step your legs side to side, and we're gonna actually, this will be one of our first exercises. So I just want you to move side to side. Nice full um, picture, Rosemary. Like it's a, are you on a, not a phone anymore, it looks like. All right, roll your shoulders back and around. I got a wide picture of you today. It's usually just short up and down. All right, roll your shoulders back and around. We're just doing a side to side lunge, and we're gonna work with those in our first set in four, Three, two, come to the center, hands on your hips, just drop your hips and lift up. Little plies. Take it down, take it up. Good, take your arms with you now, down and up, down and up. Squeeze your glutes, nice and strong. Four more, three more, two more. Hold your arms overhead on one. Stay here and just pulse. Knee, hips open, knees open, three, Good, doesn't matter how low you go right now. Just get that mobility, four more. Four, three, two, hold it down, arms up. Take the arms behind you, interlace your fingers. Turn your toes forward, bring them a little closer, fold over, hang your head down, arms up over your head. Good, then release your hands to the floor. Look forward, bend the knees, drop your hips. Exhale, extend the legs, forward fold. Inhale, extend your hips, press your chest forward. Exhale, fold, stay here. Grab opposite elbows, sway a little side to side. Switch the cross of the arms and come back to center. And just roll yourself up to standing, roll the shoulders back and around. Quick little hug of the knee, open it out. Other knee, open it out. Take two sets, two weights. You can do light weights, you can do heavy weights. We're gonna take it into that first movement that we did in our warm up, which is a side to side lunge. So you wanna get nice and wide. And again, you don't have to go that low. And as we do that, we're gonna alternate bicep curls. All right? So grab a set, that's right. <laughs> we're gonna grab a set of weights. Moderate to heavier if you're feeling like, and if you don't have weights, just use your body weight. Yeah, or whatever you might be holding onto there, water bottles. All right, feet are wide. We're gonna do 10 rounds. Three, two, go. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, good, come back to center. Walk your feet in closer. Lift one heel, so lift your right heel. Come down to the floor or come down with your hip hinge. Three, two, go. Now, come down to deadlift. When you come up, side bend, bend side arm, raise. So two, same side. Left leg is down, right leg is, right heel is lifted. Three, good. You know, you can do this with as much energy and no weight as you'd like. Five more. Weight is still in the left leg. Next time we do this, we'll have the weight in the other leg. Six. Seven, of course I left my water inside. Eight. Two more. Boogie. Nine. One more, it's 10. Put the weights down. Left elbow to right knee. So right arm's gonna come out to the side. Right leg is gonna come up and across. 10 on the right side. Three, two, go. 10, Woo. nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, so we're crossing the body, three, one more, and down. Roll it around, shake it out, get up and boogie. All right, so now we're gonna go back to the lunges with your bicep curls. Step your feet wide, nice big step out. Alternating side to side with the bicep curl in three, two, we'll go. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, don't rock the boat, nine, one more, and 10. Good, bring your feet closer together. I'll just do it easy standing up. Weight is in the right leg. Left heels lifted, deadlift with bent arms sideways in three, two, go. Down, come up, one. So keep your elbows in line or lower than your shoulders, two. If you're not using weight, find some dynamic tension in your arms, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, two more, one more, good, put the weights down, left leg is going to lift up, right hand behind your head, left arm out to the side, stay bent in both knees, cross the body in three, two, we go, ten, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two more, one more, and that's it. All right, take your hands behind your head, turn your toes out. We're going to rotate the torso to the right, come back to center, rotate to the left center. Keep the lower half of your body still, you can come into a lower squat. If you'd like to, you can even stay on your toes if you'd like to. So just twist side to side in three, two, go. Turn, center, turn, center. Two, three, four, five, six, sit lower if you want, seven, eight, nine, and one more, 10, good. So I actually just read an article um, about training your obliques and you can do them every day, stuff that we already knew, exercises we already knew. Twisting, I know some of you can't twist at this point, but some of you can twist, um, is very good. The amount of twisting you do, the rotation, doesn't have to be huge, right? It could be just a really small movement, so you can do this every day. All right, we're gonna go back to a side lunge, but we're gonna stay on one side this time. You're gonna hold the weight to your chin or chest. Step out with one leg, so we'll call it the right leg. As you squat down, you're gonna come back up to standing, but we're not gonna step our feet in. So we're gonna sit back and come back up. Same side, right side. All right, hands up, legs wide, weight underneath your chin or no weight at all in three, two, go. Hips go back 10, nine, so I'll just turn this way for a second. Three, four, five, six, seven, two more, one more. Good, all right, pick up a second set of weights. Heavier if you'd like to go heavier for bent over rows. So if your legs, if you're using the same weights, you can keep your legs wide or you can bring your legs in closer. Bend over, knees bent, chest back, sh chest open, shoulders back in three, two, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one more. And stand up. Good. No weights needed. Similar to what we did before, but it's going to be called a repeater. So your right leg is going to come up and down with that cross body rotation. All right. So weights in the left leg. Don't straighten and bend the left leg. Keep it bent the whole time. In three, two, go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. Back to holding on to one weight. I'll make it this weight. Step out to the wide stance. Left leg is gonna bend and straighten in three, 
two, go. Bend, come back up one. So keep your weight behind your heel, two, three, four, drive through the left heel. Five more. Five, four, three, two, one more. Good, pick up your second weight for bent over rows. Choose the weight you're gonna use, big muscles, just saying. Or on um, those where you can use a towel and just take it and pull it back behind you. Three, two, go. 10, nine, or eight, <laughs> seven, you're being ingenious, I go. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring the weights down. Right leg is bent, stays bent. Cross body with the left knee in three, two, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. Good, separate your legs wide. Stay very low for those of you who can. Nice and low, so hands are down, hips are down. I just want you to roll side to side, lower than you did in the first set. In three, two, go. One, two, if you wanna to touch the floor, that's okay. Get your hips nice and low, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last two, and 10. Come back to center, walk your feet in, roll yourselves up, grab one heavy weight or two lighter weights or two heavy weights, or if you only have a towel, you can take one arm and pull against the towel if you'd like, right? Or whatever you're using for weights in your ingenious way. All right, separate your legs wide, arms up, Elbows point forward, three, two, plie and tricep, one. All the way down up, two, you have to use the towel. Three, four, five, six, seven, I also left my towel inside, eight, <laughs> nine, one more, 10. Good, take two weights, Moderate to heavy, please. Uh, use your towel. You, you can even stand on your towel, Rosemary, because it looks like a big towel, and do curls this way, okay? So um, the rest of us are gonna do bicep curls with a negative, so on the way down, it's a little slower than on the way up. All right, so in three, two, let's curl the arms up. One, now slow, slow, slow. That's two, come down, nice and slow. Three. Four, five, six, what is that, a furniture? <laughs> Seven, a cushion? <laughs> Eight, or an ottoman? <laughs> Nine, we get ingenious. And 10, good, put the weights down. Step your feet wide again, bring your hands behind your head. Elbows out to the side. Tick tock, leaning to the side behind your hip. Three, two, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, uh -uh -uh. seven. Nice and eight, welcome. Nine, some weights in your body. Don't be sorry, 10, and come on back up. All right, so we're on the second round of a plie with a tricep. Um, so grab a hold of your one or two weights to take overhead. Arms come up, elbows point forward, hips are open. We're gonna come down and up with both the arms and the hips in three, in two, and one, go for 10. 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one more, and down. Good, grab a hold of the second weight if you don't have it already. Bicep curls high. Bicep curls with a negative on the way down. So faster on the way up, slower on the way down. In three, in two, in one. Curl up, one, slow, 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 slow. Two. Three. Four. Slow and control. Five. Six. Take at least four counts on the way down. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Slow, 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 slow. Take your weights down, stand wide, hands behind your head, elbows out to the side. Start on the left side this time. In three, two, tick tocks, go. One, try to get your elbow behind your knee or behind your hip. Three, you're in one plane. Four, not forward and back, just side to side. Five, Ah, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, we're going to stay in this position, ten, good, bring your hands in, weights or not, light weights if you're using weights, cross body punches in three, two, we go, one, one, two, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Easy enough. All right, now come on back to um, bent over rows. Two weights, bent over rows. Heavy weights, we're going to do ten reps. Pick it up. So just the arms here. Three, two, go. Row ten, nine, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two more. One more. Stand up. Good. Put one weight down. Arms overhead, legs wide if you'd like. Or just the arms in three, two, tricep overhead. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Stabilize your lower body. Six. Five, four, three, two, one. Second weight, back up. Biceps with negatives. In three, two, curl up one. One, slow, 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 slow. Two, three, four. Five, six, I'll sing to you. Coming from my disco section of my rowing class. Eight, two more. And one more. Good, step your feet a little bit wider. Hinge forward, bent over rows. I'm gonna have to find a towel of some sort here. In three, in two, go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. One weight overhead. Stay nice and strong. Either you're in a plie or a wide leg stance. Three, two, go. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, 
Tres. One more. Woo. All right. Last time for the bicep curls with the negatives. In three, two, curl up. One, slow, slow, slow. Two. Three. Four. Slow it down on the way down, whatever you're doing. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. I always forget when I take my towel in to immediately replace it. Ten. One. Two. And down. All right, guys. I'm going to get a towel. Take your weights, take your uh, mat to the floor. No cheating, get on the floor. Don't hang out too long. It's just too hot in South Florida to not have a towel and water. Okay, take your mats and take your uh, cameras down to the floor, right? Take your weights with you. All right, first set, light weights, please. If you have light weights, if you don't have weights, that's okay, just use, you know, body weight. Mama. All right, I believe these are light. So, you're gonna come onto your back. You're gonna hold the bridge. And in our bridge today, we're gonna to have our hips, uh, our feet in line with your hips and then slight turn out with the, the hips. So line up with your sitting bones and then turn your toes out. Come up onto your, uh, come into your bridge. Keep your arms, or keep your hips up, excuse me. And we're gonna take one arm back and one arm forward, like a dead bug in a bridge. We're going to alternate arms for 10. So lift your hips up, turn your toes out, squeeze your glutes. Right arm back, left arm forward in three, two, and go. One. All the way down and back up. One. Other side. Two. Three. Four. Keep lifting your hips up higher. Five. They're tempted to go down. Six. Put a slight bend in the elbows. They don't have to be locked. Eight. Nine. Ten. Hips down. Arms down. Come onto your hands and knees. Choose to stay on your hands and knees for a push-up. Or take it higher onto a bench, a table, uh, or hold a plank. All right, arms are gonna be wide on this push-up. Knees down or up, you choose. Shoulders over wrists. All right, so you can go against a couch, a table, a wall. Three, two, go for 10. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, one more. Good, sit back in child's pose. All right, you're still on your hands and knees. Mea culpa. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips. Hips and shoulders width apart. Tuck your toes, lift your knees an inch off the floor. Bring the right knee to the right chest, left knee to the chest. All right, so you're in a hovering tabletop position, or you can do this again against a wall, against a bench, a table to be higher. But don't let your knees lift too high. So get your legs wide as well so you don't wobble. Three, two, go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down. All right, back on your backs. Is a bend. All right. Lay on your back. Take your lighter set of weights for your dead bug in a bridge. Dead bug in a bridge, dead bug arms. So your heels line up with your sitting bones. 
Turn your toes out, arms up. Lift your hips up. Keep your hips lifting up. Keep pushing against the floor with your shoulders and your feet. In three, right arm goes back, two, one. One, slow and controlled. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hips down, arms down. Hands and knees set up for your push up, however, you choose to do your push up. On the knees, on the toes, or holding maybe just a plank or higher up on a wall, a bench. Three, two, go. Ten, nine, belly in. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Nine, good row. And ten, sit back. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips, toes tucked under, hover an inch off the ground. Three, two, knee into the chest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ten. Down. Back on your backs. Take your light weights again. All right. This time, bring your, this is a little just more challenge back into our dead bug. Both legs and arms are up. So now the right arm and the left leg are going to extend, and then we'll switch sides. So this one's arm and leg. Belly in, ribs down. Right arm, and the legs are over the hips, not in front of the chest. Uh, if you have to be on the floor, then you'll just do it from the floor up. In three, Two, go. Right arm, left leg, straight or bent on the leg. Two, three, really? I want you to really focus on the center of your body. Four, pulling the ribs down, belly in. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now stay here. Both arms and legs together. Three, two, go. One, two, head and shoulders up is optional. Three, lower legs, more stress. Four, in a good way and a not so good way. Five, too much stress on your back, don't do it. It's not enough stress on your back, go lower. Seven, well I don't mean stress on your back, stress on your center. Eight, never want stress on the back. Nine, and 10. Good, come on back up. All right. Whew. Love Florida in the heat of the summer. Come to your hands and knees. All right. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips again. Fire hydrants. If you don't do this on your knees, you can do a side lying bent knee lift or standing up doing the same thing. All right. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips. We're gonna alternate side to side in three, two, go. Right, left, that's one, two, three, Cindy, you're frozen just so you know, but I hope you can hear me. We're doing five hydrants, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, this is an exercise that never gets better. <laughs> 10, no matter what you do, it never gets better. All right, we're gonna take it onto the right side. I'll kind of turn, well, I'll try to give you the best view. All right, shoulder hit the ankle. Bend your knees so that your knees are still in line with your hips and in line with your heels. Heels are gonna stay together Top leg is gonna lift up and down. Now you're lifting out of your waistline here, out of your neck and shoulders, all right? The feet stay together, it's a clamshell. But the knee is gonna open up apart. Three, 
two, let's go, ten, nine, three, really feel this outer hip, good, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now, arm up. Either the top leg only is going to come up, or both legs are going to come up. They're going up and down to the ceiling, not towards your chest. So try to keep that action, outer hip as well. Left arm up. No collapsing in the right side. Three, two, go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. Sit up. Just cross your left leg, the top leg, over the right, and do a little twist here. Come on back, reverse it, and come back to your hands and knees. So we All right, hydrants, whichever way you chose to do them before, side lying, standing, kneeling. In three, let's start with our left leg. Two, one, one, up, two, Ex not too much excess leaning, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, good, okay, oh, just came apart. All right, you're gonna go lying onto your left side, unless that was the side you did before. Left side lying. Oops. All right, shoulder hips, knees ankle, one line. Bend the knees 90 degrees, lift out of your left side body. Heels stay together. Top leg looks like a clamshell. In three, two, ten, nine, eight. Right here into your glute medius. Four, five, stable. Six, outer hip. All the way down the outside of the leg. TFL. Eight, nine, ten. Now stay here. Right arm up, either just one leg at a time or two legs come up in three, two, and go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. Good, all right. Come to sitting. Let's do this today on our forearms, so lean back. You're in a lean back position, bent knees. Lift the legs off the floor. You can also do this on your back, all the way down the floor. All right, knees in and out from your chest in three, two, go, one, one, two. Now, if you wanna be upright, you can. You can also let go of your hands. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Okay, now, let's take those two lighter weights, lay on your back. Arms back up over your chest. So you can also have one heavy weight, two heavy weights, or just stick with these light weights. As you come up, let's take our arms apart. So separate the arm shoulder width apart. Tilt your pelvis. Inhale. Bring yourself up to sitting with the arms overhead, and then roll down. Now, if that's not happening, we're gonna do a crunch right here, all right? And if that's not happening, take the weights down, put your hands behind your head, all right? So arms up over shoulders. With a minimal amount of uh, momentum, roll yourself up in three, two, go. One, all the way up, all the way down. Two, round your back. Three, woo, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. I'm glad I chose lighter weights. Nine. Good one. That's it. Ten. Stay up. Take one arm down, one arm up. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bring your weights down. Come onto your backs again. Hug your knees into your chest. Bring your feet down if you'd like to put weights on your pelvis. That's fine. Or have weights in the air holding over your shoulders. Or no weights at all. Take your arms down. This time the heels and the toes point forward. Tilt your pelvis. Lift your hips in the air. Roll your shoulders underneath you if you're not using any weights. Good. Now, stay in a separate position. Squeeze just your right butt cheek in three, two, go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, hold the contraction. Squeeze just your left butt cheek. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, both butt cheeks are squeezing. Now squeeze them together for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, uh, hold it up here. Side to side, right and left. A little booty dance. Three, two, go. Right, left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Everything squeeze together. Lift a little higher. Lift a little higher. Lift a little higher. Now articulate down, relax all the way down. Bring your knees towards each other. Hug your knees into your chest. Cross right over left, grab ankle, shin to toes. Open your arms to a T. Shift your hips right, let your knees fall over to the left side. Spinal twist. Cross your legs, come to center. Cross left leg over right, grab ankle, shins, or toes. Open your arms to the side, move your hips left, let your knees fall to the right. Uncross your legs, come back to center. All right, one more time. Roll up to get your light set of weights. Your lighter set of weights, you're back on your back, the sit-ups with the shoulders, all right? So on your back, arms up. You can change the position of your arms, so palms can face in or palms face away. In three, two, one. Sit all the way up, one, or you're doing a crunch. Two. Three. Four. Round your spine. Five. Six, seven, eight, we stay up on ten, nine, stay up on ten, right arm, left arm, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. One more. Good, bring it down. A lot harder when you don't have your whole body assisting you in the pose. Or the presses. Lay down on your back. Put a weight on your pelvis if that's what you like to do. Or use weights in the air. Heels in line with your sitting bones. Pull your back into the floor. Lift your hips up. Roll your shoulders underneath you. Let's start on the left butt cheek only. Three, two, squeeze the left cheek. 10, 9, 
eight, seven, six. When you're at one, you hold it. Three, two, hold it. Right side, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it. Both together, squeeze. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it here. Right, left, alternate, go one. One, two, three. Not a whole lot of swaying in your hips. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hold everything together for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. Let it go. Ooh. All right, hug your knees back to your chest. You guys are pretty delicious now. Cross the right leg over the left, grab the ankle, shins, or the toes. Open your arms to a T, shift your hips right, let your knees fall over to the left side. Uncross the legs, come back to center. Left leg over right, grab hold of the ankles. Open your arms to a T, shift over to the right side. Uncross the legs, come back to center. Bring the knees back to the chest one more time. Put your left foot on the floor, cross your right ankle through your core. Keep your feet on the floor right now. Push your right leg away. Keep the action of the leg pushing against the uh, top of the thigh. Open your arms to a T. Move your hips to the left and let your knees fall over to the right. Send your left leg a little bit more to the left side. IT band. Uh, left arm overhead. Right arm, just pressing down on either thigh. I like it on the inside of the right leg. It just kind of brings that crease away from the hip and the knee, or the hip and the thigh. Release the arms. Come back to center, release the legs. Put your right foot on the floor. Put your left ankle above your right knee. Take your left hand to the inside of the right th uh, left thigh. Push it away from you. Now keep that action without the arm helping. Shift your hips right, let your knees fall left, and then send your right leg a little bit more to the right side, if that works for you. Right arm overhead, left arm on either leg. I like it on the inside of the left. Oh, it just opens it up so nicely. And release the arm slowly. Come back. Uncross the legs, hug your knees back to your chest, open your legs wide, hold to the outside of your feet, tailbone down. And then bring your legs in together. Bring yourself to your hands and knees or standing up to your um, hands on your thighs. Tabletop position, tuck the toes, arch the back. Exhale, round and curls and cat and cow. Inhale, arch the back. Exhale, round and curl. Inhale, arch the back. Find neutral. Take the right arm forward and the left leg back. Level out your hips. Bird dog. Yeah, thumb up to the sky. Three, two. Down, other side. Left arm forward, right leg back. Drop the right hip level. Come back down. Step your right foot forward. Hands on the inside. You can do this standing. Bend your uh, right knee over the ankle. Take your right hand on your thigh, twist open. Stretch the right arm out. Right 
you. I'm on the inside. Straighten your front leg, toes up. Bend your knee. Really nice to open up the hip flexors, especially those of you who are sitting all day at your computers. Take your right leg back, stretch back to child's pose. Come back to center, take the left leg forward, hands on the inside. Send your weight away from your back knee. Left hand on the thigh, open up the twist. Left arm opens up. Down inside, straighten the front leg. Rebend your front knee. Take your left leg by your right leg, push back to child's pose. Keep your hips elevated if it's too extreme on your knees. Come to your hands and knees, tuck your toes, downward facing dog. Hands can be on a wall, block. Tabletop, chair, desk, sofa. Bend one knee at a time. And then find some stillness and downward dog for a few breaths. Let everything go. Soften your knees, look forward, and walk your feet and hands towards each other. Where we started, hands behind your back, and place your fingers, palms together, knuckles up and overhead. Take out your head, yes and no. Let go of your arms, let them dangle. Tuck the chin into your chest. Roll up to standing. Roll the shoulders around, take a big breath in. Take a hold of your hands, interlace your fingers, lean up and over the right side. Inhale back and over the other side. Inhale, back up. Open your arms like a cactus. Lift your heart up. Exhale, close your arms around you. Pat yourself on the back. Open your arms and do the other side. And then open up. Give yourself a big hand. Hump day. You made it. Stay home safe, but stay healthy.